in. No gunshots, but they get in. Low, low. What's going on guys, Asian Sensation, today we got a video explaining the new update that recently came out, update 3.1 for um, BTD Battles. So here are all of the new features included. So Ninja Kiwi did a huge change to the game, um, really is going to affect how Mobile King of the Hill goes um, and in terms of strategies and it's just gonna be a lot different. So, first off, the dart market. Now, instead of being $330, the trip darts went up $50 to become $380. That's not too huge of a factor, but it still is, it matters a lot early game, because usually, now people are at the point where they know exactly how much money they'll have at certain points to like afford triple dart stuff, and now that all of that's changed, so that's gonna be a big factor. The glue gunner, um, they decreased a lot of stuff you can see for the glue gunner. That's good. Nobody even uses the glue gunner, so that's good that they're trying to get people to use it more, I guess, by decreasing the cost of everything. Uh, Monkey Apprentice, Tempest Tornado decreased to 4,500. That's interesting. It was 8,000 previously, and maybe people will be using that now, but I'm not a wizard person. Dragon, Dragon's Breath is now 3600 I think it was 4500 before. So that's about a 20% decrease. Um, it's pretty big, but Dragon's Breath alone can't even defend a round 13 rush. So definitely don't prefer going Wizards early game, especially. Not even late game either. So, like, never. Um, Monkey Buccaneer, aircraft carrier, went down from... I think 12,500 or is 15,000 to 9,000. Um, most people don't really use that high of monkey buccaneers, and if they do, they go for the right side to take down those BFBs with the grapple thing. And okay, this is a big one. The monkey sub airburst arts cost is increased to $1,000, so that's a $200 increase. That's going to really affect early game. Plus. You can see here, they decreased the main weapon fire rate. So, the airburst darts used to be incredibly, incredibly OP. You could just have one airburst dart, get it up, start round two, and you'd be fine until like round eight. Um, sometimes even ten on some maps if it was Battle Park. And that's just crazy. So, that is a good update on that. It is going to affect the gameplay a lot though. Especially for maps like um, Ice Flow and just a lot of sub maps uh, water hazard and such and here we go we got the mortar monkey now um, I don't know I don't really use the mortar nobody really uses the mortar but this might change because of the cost reduction and the range increase so who knows maybe people will go mortar now uh, the ninja monkey Sabo supply lines is now 4,000 instead of 2,800. So that's a huge increase, about like 30% or so. Um, that's just crazy. So that's going to affect gameplay as well. When you're trying to micro, you may think you have enough, but you forget that it's 4,000 now. So that's going to happen to me a few times, I guarantee it. Especially on eco maps, um, like Ice Flow, especially for those around 20 and 22 rushes, you're going to need 1,200 more dollars. So. That's gonna be a big factor. Distractions, $150 increase. Now it is $500, just like in Flash. Um, Sniper Monkey, supply drop decreased. Spike Factory, just some minor things on that. Um, yeah. Uh, let's see, bug fixes, yeah. General changes. Okay, so now there are short rounds that now have extra balloons added to increase their length. So that is now. Um, Round 12, I just played a game recently, and now there is no camel balloons on round 12. Well, at least not at the beginning. So, it's not just one camel balloon. There are balloons, and then maybe a camel at the end. I honestly don't remember, but... Yeah, it's, it's different. And they also fixed the skip map glitch, so now you can't skip at the last second to auto-pick the enemy's layout, if you know that glitch. And here are the two biggest ones, in my opinion. The Cobra and Banana Farm. So, the Cobra Monkey... Attrition no longer takes opponents below one health. So basically you can't kill your opponent with attrition, which is an incredibly awesome update. I love that. I hated that so much because 
when you're getting a decent player in like battle arena say and you both get up your fourth tier farm then it, all you do is just spam cobras on the entire map zero two and it's basically whoever gets more lucky and i just hate that so much so i'm glad that you can't die to attrition and they also give you thirty dollars instead that's okay i guess but anyways banana farm base cost has increased a hundred dollars to eleven hundred that's gonna affect early game especially all of these banana farms are gonna affect early game so more bananas went up fifty dollars so now a one zero costs fourteen hundred fifty dollars instead of the thirteen hundred dollars which is a pretty big increase especially since farms are used so heavily in mobile and the banana plantation has increased a hundred dollars and then the only thing that didn't get increased on the left side is the research facility which or no the banana republic that stayed the same 3200 so but the research facility went up ten thousand or one thousand dollars and it's now fifteen thousand dollars instead of the original fourteen thousand dollars so if i do my math right let's see 1100 plus 350 29 uh that's like 20 it's a lot more <laughs> it is increased a lot more to get up a four zero farm than before um yeah so over fifteen hundred dollars that's crazy so that's gonna affect farming and eco so balloon economy may be more viable now than it was before more people would probably be going balloon eco so that's gonna change it a lot and let's see what else the boomerang that's decent maybe it will be used more i highly doubt it though to, to be honest i don't think people will be using boomer much just because of it's a late game deficits um okay here's the last page um the balloon shipper super wide th funnel is increased from 4500 to 8000 that's almost double its price so that's a big change i like that change but i still think they should have made super back about at least twelve thousand dollars instead of the six thousand because it's so overpowered um you can just stall the entire game so anyways that's it for today i hope you enjoyed i'm probably going to be getting up another video of battles of the mobile or not Battles of the mobile, mobile king of the hill up later tonight so stay tuned for that and i'm out